I don't know why anybody would adopt an animal just to do that. I, I don't, you know, I don't understand. A woman from High Point in serious trouble after police say she dumped a dead two-year-old puppy in a neighborhood. It happened in mid-March off Oakland Place, a road just outside of downtown High Point. That's where we find Fox 8's Madison Forsey tonight. Madison, what a disturbing thing for neighbors to find. Yeah, it absolutely was. I spoke to one woman today, and as she told us the story, it brought her to tears. She detailed how she heard a car zoom down this street, and then she heard a bang, a sound she believes was the crate with the animal being thrown out of the car, hitting right here on the sidewalk. Knowing what I know, imagining what the animal had gone through to get to that point was just heartbreaking. Disturbing is how Kimberly Volkman describes the moment she and a neighbor realized what was inside this cage dumped on the side of the road behind her house. I lifted the blanket long enough to see uh, some animal fur and a, and a bloody dog bowl. Um, and I told him, call the police, and I dropped the blanket. They've been dead a while. It smells pretty bad. Inside the crate, this two-year-old dog. Volkman's neighbor called 911, but she never saw an officer. Later that night, she peeked back outside. The cage was gone. Somebody took it, but dumped the dog's body on the street. Volkman called again, and the next morning, Officer Beth Cheek showed up. Disbelief a little bit um, and, and shock that people can have that less of compassion for a living, breathing creature of any sort. Officer Cheek was able to use the microchip inside the dog to get back to the owner, 46-year-old Fatima Bell. According to Guilford County Animal Services, Bell adopted the dog at the end of February. Officers charged her with felony animal cruelty. Everybody falls on hard times from time to time. We understand that, um, but to, to handle it in this way is not the way we as a organization want this to continue to happen. Officer Cheek wants people struggling to take care of their animals to reach out to them and get connected with resources they believe can help. Animals can't defend themselves. They rely on people. They get the raw end of the deal from people and it's just wrong. As of right now, there is no cause of death for the two-year-old puppy. Fatima Bell is due back in court on April 18th. In High Point, Madison Forsey, Fox 8 News.